Deep in the heart of the jungle, surrounded by a tangle of green leaves and thick branches, you spot a lively primate darting through the trees. Its movements are quick and agile, and for a moment you wonder, what exactly are you looking at? Is it a monkey or is it an ape? At first glance, it's easy to get confused. Both monkeys and apes are part of the primate family and they share many features, expressive faces, nimble hands and a love for climbing. But if you look a little closer, the differences between them become much more obvious. Once you know what to look for, you'll never mix them up again. Think of it like comparing lions and house cats. Both are felines, but you wouldn't mistake one for the other. The easiest clue when it comes to primates, tails. Most monkeys have long, flexible tails. These tails aren't just for show, they're essential tools for balance, and some monkeys, like spider monkeys, even use them as a fifth limb to grab onto branches or dangle from trees. Apes, on the other hand, are completely tailless. Not a single ape, from the smallest gibbon to the largest gorilla, has a tail. If you see a primate without a tail, you're almost certainly looking at an ape. Gorillas, chimpanzees, orangutans and gibbons all are apes and all are missing that signature monkey tail. But tails aren't the only difference. Watch how they move. Monkeys are built for speed and agility in the treetops. They run and leap along branches on all fours, using their tails for balance as they dash from tree to tree. Apes, however, have a different approach. With their long, powerful arms, they swing gracefully beneath the branches in a motion called brachiation. Gibbons are especially famous for this, gliding through the forest with incredible speed and elegance. When apes come down to the ground, they often walk on their knuckles, supporting their heavy upper bodies with strong arms. This knuckle-walking gait is unique to apes like gorillas and chimpanzees and it helps them move efficiently on land. Size is another big clue. Apes are generally much larger and more robust than monkeys. Picture a massive silverback gorilla standing next to a tiny, delicate marmoset. The difference is striking. But perhaps the most fascinating difference lies in their brains. Apes have larger, more complex brains than monkeys, which gives them advanced problem-solving abilities, the capacity to use tools and rich, intricate social lives. They form deep bonds, communicate in sophisticated ways, and even show signs of empathy and self-awareness. So, next time you see a primate in the wild or at the zoo, look for the tail, watch how it moves, and notice its size and behavior. Whether it's a tail-swinging monkey or a powerful, intelligent ape, each group is uniquely brilliant, and both have incredible stories to tell in the world of primates. To truly understand the fascinating world of monkeys and apes, we need to journey back in time, rewinding millions upon millions of years to a world very different from our own. Imagine ancient forests stretching as far as the eye can see, teeming with life and echoing with the calls of creatures that would one day become our distant relatives. All primates, lemurs, monkeys, apes and even humans are branches on the same ancient family tree. We all share a common ancestor that lived about 60 million years ago, a small tree-dwelling mammal whose descendants would spread across the globe and evolve into the diverse primate species we see today. The first major split in our primate lineage separated the lemurs and lorises from the rest. These early primates, known as prosimians, took their own evolutionary path, adapting to life in places like Madagascar and Asia developing unique features for nocturnal living and tree climbing. Fast forward to about 40 million years ago, and another dramatic split occurred. Monkeys diverged into two groups. New world monkeys, who made their home in the lush forests of the Americas, and old world monkeys, who remained in Africa and Asia. This separation shaped their evolution in remarkable ways. New world monkeys, like the clever capuchins, developed prehensile tails, almost like a fifth limb, allowing them to grasp branches and move with incredible agility through the treetops. This adaptation gave them a unique advantage in their leafy environment. In contrast, old world monkeys, such as baboons, have tails that are much shorter and not prehensile at all. Instead, they adapted to a variety of habitats, from forests to open savannas, relying more on their hands and feet for movement. Then around 25 million years ago, a remarkable transformation took place. Some old world monkeys evolved into apes. These new primates lost their tails, grew longer, stronger arms, and developed powerful shoulders. 
perfect for swinging from branch to branch in the dense forest canopy. Apes spread across Africa and Asia, becoming true specialists of the forest canopy. Gorillas, orangutans and chimpanzees all adapted to life high above the forest floor, each developing their own unique behaviors and social structures. Humans too are part of this remarkable ape family. We share a recent common ancestor with chimpanzees and bonobos, our closest living relatives, just six to seven million years ago. A blink of an eye in evolutionary terms. So when you look at your own arms or notice the absence of a tail, remember, we are apes through and through. Our long arms, upright posture and close genetic bond with our primate cousins are all reminders of our shared journey through deep time. A journey that connects us to every monkey, ape and lemur on Earth. Let's break down the blueprints. Monkeys have narrow chests, side-placed shoulder blades and long flexible spines, perfect for running on all fours and leaping through trees. Their tails are key for balance and agility. Apes have wide barrel-shaped chests and shoulder blades on their backs, giving their arms a huge range of motion for swinging. Their arms are longer and stronger than their legs and they have no tails. Monkeys thrive in diverse habitats, from rainforests to snowy mountains, thanks to their versatile bodies. Apes, larger and more specialized, need strong branches and stable forests. Monkeys are generalists, adaptable survivors. Apes are specialists, powerful but more vulnerable when their habitats are threatened. In terms of raw strength, apes are unmatched. A silverback gorilla is up to 10 times stronger than a fit human, able to snap bamboo and topple trees. Monkeys, like mandrills and baboons, are strong for their size, with powerful jaws and explosive agility, but they're not in the same league. Chimps, our closest relatives, are about four times stronger than humans and use their strength for climbing, swinging and even hunting monkeys. Apes evolved immense upper body power for their semi-upright posture and arm-driven movement. Monkeys' strength suits their nimble, fast-paced lives. But in a contest of power, apes are the undisputed champions. When danger strikes, speed is everything. And here, monkeys shine. The Patas monkey can sprint at 55 kilometers per h, the fastest primate on Earth. In the trees, monkeys are untouchable, leaping and darting with incredible agility. Their speed and coordination make them nearly impossible to catch. Apes, by contrast, are built for power, not speed. Gorillas can charge at 40 kilometers per H, but only briefly. Apes rely on strength and intimidation, not quick getaways. In a race, on the ground or in the trees, the monkey takes the gold. Intelligence is where apes truly excel. Great apes, chimps, bonobos, gorillas, orangutans show self-awareness, use tools, and can learn sign language. Chimps use sticks to fish for termites and stones to crack nuts, passing these skills down through generations. Orangutans are master problem solvers, even escaping zoo enclosures with clever tricks. Monkeys are smart too. Capuchins use tools, and baboons navigate complex social politics. But apes' intelligence is more flexible and abstract, allowing for empathy, planning, and culture. In the Brain Power Showdown, apes take the trophy. Imagine the first golden rays of sunrise breaking through the dense canopy of the Amazon rainforest. The world is waking up, and the air is filled with the promise of a new day. The forest is alive with the sounds of birds, insects and the gentle rustling of leaves as the jungle stirs to life. Among the treetops, squirrel monkeys begin to stir. They stretch, yawn and greet each other with soft chirps and playful chatter. Grooming is an important morning ritual, strengthening social bonds and keeping their fur clean. The troop is a tight-knit family and every member plays a role in the group's harmony. With boundless energy, the monkeys set off in search of breakfast. Their diet is varied and opportunistic. Fruits, insects, flowers and tender leaves are all on the menu. Foraging is a full-time job, and their small bodies require constant fuel to keep up with their active lifestyle. The troop moves together through the tangled branches, always alert. Some monkeys act as lookouts, climbing to higher vantage points to scan for danger. This teamwork is essential for survival in a forest filled with hidden threats. If a predator is spotted, a snake, a bird of prey, or even a prowling cat, 
an alarm call rings out. Instantly, the troop scatters, leaping and darting through the trees in a coordinated escape. Their agility and quick reflexes are their best defense. As the sun climbs higher, the pace slows. Midday is a time for rest and socializing. Monkeys groom each other in the dappled sunlight, while the young ones play, chase, and wrestle. These playful moments are more than just fun. They're vital lessons in climbing, balance, and social skills. As the afternoon light softens, the troop resumes its search for food. They navigate the dense forest with remarkable memory, following mental maps to the best feeding spots. Every day is a new adventure, and their survival depends on their knowledge of the forest. Communication never stops. Monkeys use a rich language of calls, gestures, and facial expressions to share information, warn of danger, and maintain group cohesion. Their social intelligence is key to their success. As dusk falls, the troop seeks out a safe high tree to spend the night. They huddle close together, sharing warmth and protection. The forest quiets and the monkeys drift to sleep, trusting in the safety of their group. Life in the monkeys' world is a constant dance of movement, play and connection. Their fast-paced social lifestyle has helped them thrive in the ever-changing rainforest, making them one of nature's most successful survivors. Now, to the forests of Central Africa, where a gorilla family starts its day slowly. Each night, apes build fresh nests from leaves and branches. Their mornings are calm, feeding on leaves and stems, led by the dominant silverback. Gorillas spend much of their day eating, their large bodies needing constant fuel. The group is peaceful, with quiet grunts and gentle interactions. Young gorillas play and wrestle while adults rest and maintain bonds through close proximity. The silverback keeps the family safe, always alert to threats. As evening falls, they build new nests and settle in for the night. An ape's day is calm, deliberate and centered on family, a world apart from the monkey's frantic pace. So who wins, monkey or ape? For strength, apes dominate. For speed, monkeys take the crown. For intelligence, apes again lead the way. But better is a human idea. Both are evolutionary success stories, perfectly adapted to their worlds. Monkeys are versatile, thriving in diverse environments with agility and numbers. Apes are specialists, strong, intelligent, and deeply social, ruling their forest homes. It's not about one being better, it's about different strategies for survival. Both monkeys and apes are our closest relatives, deserving respect, admiration, and protection. They are kings of their own kingdoms.